Hey foodies, welcome and welcome back to Cooking with Kiana. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this delicious creamy spinach stuffed salmon. This salmon is out of this world. It's stuffed with this amazing Tuscan cream cheese and spinach stuffing. If you guys are new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss weekly recipes. And make sure you hit that like button if you enjoyed this recipe. Now let's get started. For this recipe, you'll need two salmon fillets. Make sure they're nice and thick and good for stuffing. A teaspoon of Creole seasoning, one teaspoon of lemon pepper seasoning, one teaspoon of paprika, and one teaspoon of garlic powder. And I'm gonna be using these seasonings to season up that salmon. One cup of fresh chopped baby spinach, six ounces of chive and onion flavored cream cheese spread. Make sure you guys get the chive and onion one, okay? Not the regular. A half a cup of shredded mozzarella cheese. A half a cup of grape tomatoes and you're gonna go ahead and make sure you cut those in half like you see right here a half a cup of diced red bell pepper one third cup of diced onions one teaspoon of Italian seasoning one teaspoon of lari seasoning and one teaspoon of black pepper all right so first we're gonna start off by making our stuffing so what you're gonna do is you're gonna grab a skillet add a generous amount of oil and then add in those onions the bell peppers and your grape tomatoes go ahead and follow that up by adding in the lari seasoning and the black pepper now you're going to go ahead and give that a good stir until those onions are nice and translucent and everything has softened up a bit now once that has softened up you're going to go ahead and add in your baby spinach go ahead and stir that in and let that spinach cook until it starts to wilt down and honestly that's only going to take you about a minute or two once you're all done cooking the spinach, go ahead and remove it from the pan and add it into a large bowl. And to that, you're gonna go ahead and add in six ounces of cream cheese. Make sure you're using that onion and chives cream cheese spread. That's gonna really up the flavor in this stuffing. Okay, so now you're gonna go ahead and add in a teaspoon of Italian seasoning. Go ahead and mix that all together. And then you're gonna gradually add in your half a cup of mozzarella cheese. Then you're gonna go ahead and stir that all together until it's a nice creamy and thick consistency like you guys see right here. Then go ahead and place that in the freezer for about 15 minutes. And in the meantime, we can get started on our salmon fillets. So in order to stuff these, you're going to start off by cutting into the thickest part of the salmon. Go ahead and slide that knife through, but make sure you don't slide it all the way through so you don't end up cutting this in half. You're just going to go ahead and make a pocket. Go ahead and open that up so that pocket is fully exposed. Then go in with the knife and go ahead and cut that on an angle. That way you can get a really deep pocket so you can really fill these salmons up. Now, once you're done cutting those pockets into your salmon, we can go ahead and get started on seasoning up this salmon. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix together my Creole seasoning, the lemon pepper, the paprika, and the garlic powder. I'm gonna go ahead and mix that all together until that's well combined. That way you have an even distribution of the seasoning over the salmon. So once we got that all set, it is time to get started on the seasoning. So I'm gonna start off by drizzling a generous amount of olive oil over my salmon. That way that the seasonings could really stick to them. I'm also gonna make sure I open that up and get right in those pockets as well because I'm gonna season those pockets up as well. Now I'm gonna go in with those seasonings that you just saw me mix together. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add a generous amount So you want to make sure you use all of the seasoning. As you see, I didn't mix a lot because I know we're only using two salmons. So you're going to go ahead and flip that over. Make sure you get the skin side as well. You always want to make sure you season both sides, okay? And if you're not into the skin, you can go ahead and leave that skin out. But I like to leave the skin on it as a little bit more flavor to the salmon. So you're going to go in and just rub those seasonings into your salmon. And then, of course, you're going to go ahead and open up that pocket. Make sure you get that seasoning in the pocket as well. And now we can go ahead and take our stuffing out of the freezer so you can stuff it into your salmon filet. And the reason why you want to put it in the freezer for about 15 minutes is just so that stuffing can get nice and firm. So when you go ahead and stuff these, you want to make sure you really pack them in. So make sure you're pushing it real deep into those pockets so none of that stuffing seeps out when we get to cooking them. Make sure you're being gentle while stuffing. That way that salmon filet does not break on you like you see mine did right here. Now once that salmon is nice and stuffed, it is time to start the searing process. 
So you're going to go ahead and add a generous amount of oil into a cast iron skillet. Let that oil heat up on a medium to high heat. Once that is nice and hot, it is time to add in your salmon fillets. Make sure you gently add that in so none of that stuffing falls out. And we're going to cook this on each side until it's nice and golden brown and crispy. So it's going to cook for about four to five minutes on each side. Just keep in mind that the cook time does vary depending on how big or thick your salmon fillet slices are. And if you guys are enjoying this recipe so far, go ahead and leave me a like on this video and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you guys don't miss weekly recipes. So once your salmon is done searing on both sides, you're going to go ahead and flip that salmon back over so the skin side is facing down. And remember, when you guys are flipping these over, make sure you be as gentle as possible so none of that stuffing falls out. And if it does, just go ahead and pack that right back in. Now that your salmon is nice and stuffed and looking all beautiful and delicious, you're going to go ahead and add two tablespoons of butter. Let that melt. Once that melts, you're going to add a teaspoon of Italian seasoning and go ahead and mix that together so you can make a nice little garlic herb butter sauce. Now you're going to go ahead and grab the handle of your pan, tilt that to the side and use your spoon to baste it with that herb butter sauce. I'm telling you guys, that's going to infuse it with some more flavor. It's going to make your salmon nice and juicy. And it's going to definitely bring that stuffed salmon to the next level. And when you're all done, you'll have this amazing, creamy, Tuscan spinach stuffed salmon. And when I tell you this is so delicious, you guys definitely need to give this recipe a try. You will thank me later. This was definitely a 10 out of 10. Super quick, super easy, not to mention delicious. So now let's go ahead and get this all plated up so I could cut into it and show you guys what it's looking like. I'm gonna go ahead and plate this up. And my oh my, this is looking really good. I cannot wait to cut into this. Look at that salmon guys. Just look at how juicy and creamy that salmon is. It's perfect. Just look at how flaky and moist that salmon is. I'm telling you guys, this recipe is sure to impress anybody that you serve this to. That is why I left the full recipe in the description box below so you guys can make this at home. Make this for your friends and family. When you guys do make this, make sure you comment below let me know how it turned out. And like this video if you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.